It's the Weekly World News with your host, Greg W. Schneider III. Good evening, everyone, and now to Antarctica. We haven't been there yet. It seems tourists from one of the cruises to the frozen continent, they were wandering off and entered a giant ice cavern that was recently discovered. It was apparently lit from above by the Austral Borealis, which is the southern version of the Aurora Borealis, which we have up in the north, and bioluminescent starfish. Whoa. Let me quote Mrs. Jerry Yazbek on the incredible sight they encountered. It was like an ice palace disco. Penguins and seals were partying, and I guess you could say in their own awkward way were dancing. Our tour guide rushed us out saying we shouldn't be so close to wild creatures. It's been more than a month, and no one's heard anything more about their experience. I guess it's hush-hush. Well, our sleuths at Weekly World News have seen reports that scientists and conservationists want to protect the cavern. Bravo. I say bravo. They want to protect it from more tourists and outside exploitation. And I agree, imagine cell phone toting day trippers harassing the fun loving creatures. I mean, who wants to be partying and have just people sticking cell phones and cameras in your face while you're trying to dance? Anyway, keep partying, you wonderful creatures. And hopefully you're playing our music. But I guess they make their own music. They probably clap their flippers or something. Oh well, whatever. <laughs> Thank you.